It matters where you buy bundles. Haxify. The latest central event is a copy and paste of the previous event. The key thing here are the battle cores, advanced battle cores, sentinels, and the HQ skin token. Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of State of Survival at Wacker Rush Gaming. In today's video, I'm going to try to explain why I believe the sentinels are a great value choice, especially if you're a spender. The HQ skin exchange token for me personally is not worth it because State of Survival has been pushing out so many freaking new features so you need to ask yourself how much money do you want to spend to get another HQ skin on top of everything else that you need to spend these days. Rank 1 to rank 15 will get the HQ skin and Guardian skin exchange token whereas those ranking 16 to 50th will just get the HQ skin exchange token. Most high spenders will have these HQ skins and second the Guardian skin effect is temporary so if you want to follow the smart gorilla i would suggest to skip the hq skin now the sentinels are a smart way to get more starts at a huge discount rhythm girl statue lucky statue rusty statue each you need 23 permits which is going to cost you a lot more money for only two percent troop lethality two percent troop health and an extra 2000 march capacity whereas the sentinels i got the sentinels for 100 dollars today which gives me an additional three percent troop lethality and three percent troop health which is stackable the general sentinel frags were available to me to use from the last event to this one that means any additional general sentinel frags you can keep them for the the next sentinel event this is better than jump's favorite rusty statue if you're a spender i would definitely recommend to get the sentinel today primarily due to the advanced battle course for 100 dollars that i'm spending on the sentinels i'm going to be able to get the limitless syringe or the behemoth badges for free these are worth 100 dollars each can you see what i'm seeing buy one and get another free it's also a heck of a lot cheaper than those freaking statues and a heck of a lot more worth than those hq skin exchange tokens want to save more money then why not get your sentinels by using paxify well that's getting your bundles with paxify paxify offers state of survival players 10% to 25% discount in game. Many of you have seen price rises and why pay more when you can use Paxify to buy your bundles at a cheaper price. Many of these top 100 solo players are already saving themselves a heck of a lot of money using Paxify. So what are you waiting for? Make sure to check out the link in the description below and thank you Paxify for sponsoring this video. Now let's talk about how you're going to get the sentinels. There are two ways to get the sentinels. I'm going to start with the spenders way. You need 20 general sentinels frags to get these sentinels the general sentinel frags actually got carried over unless kg decided to change it without telling anyone as they always seem to do these days by completing three circuit repair objectives that's one general sentinel fragments so you'll get seven in total for seven days you can buy more sentinel fragments in the sentinel stores if you can afford it to get them all today however i highly recommend that you complete the circuit repair objective every day even if you got your sentinels already especially since those general sentinel fragments can be carried over but to complete the objectives you need restoration chips restoration chips can be easily obtained by doing any daily task assigned in the task challenges event page there is daily activity and points activity both pretty easy you can also get those sentinel fragments for free but you need to be fast and know what you need to do for the surprise task list challenges Finally, for those battle cores and advanced battle cores, if the initiator has sentinels activated and summons the frenzy officer, then all the team members joining the rally will get 200% more battle cores. The event lasts for 7 days, so joiners can get up to 36 battle cores per day, especially joining initiators with sentinels, and those that own sentinels can get up to 3 advanced battle cores per day. Therefore, in total for 7 days, that's 200 116 battle cores and 21 advanced battle cores. As a reminder, only those that own sentinels will get the advanced battle cores. You need the sentinels activated to get the advanced battle cores. Don't forget that. With the battle cores and advanced battle cores, you can grab either the syringe or the badges effectively for free. However, a huge big warning make sure you use up all your battle cores or advanced battle cores by the end of this event, otherwise they'll be recycled for some 
put resources back to you. Well, that's all folks. Thanks for watching. I hope you find this video helpful. If you do, please smash that subscribe button, leave a comment and turn on your notifications bell for more amazing videos. Thank you. Goodbye.